Hey everybody, this is Buddy. Well, I got an interesting story to tell you today. We went to the Barrack School, that's where that cannon is, and right behind it is the Fisherman's Village. And at the Fisherman's Village, I saw a guy coming in on a kayak, and he got off on to the water's edge with a kite board. And we knew instantly that there had been a guy that had been from the Royalton that had put the word out he lost a, um, a, a kite board. He was a mile out from the Royalton. And so Brian approached the, the fisherman that had found the board. He bought it and with Jamaican money. And literally, the rest of the story is Brian found the guy at the Royalton. And so we took him the board and he paid uh, a finder's fee to Brian. And this is the rest of the story where we met the guy. It's so cool. Stay tuned. Here it is. Hey everybody, this is Buddy. We ain't gonna believe this, but this guy lost his board way out there. He was almost a half a mile, mile out. And uh, we actually found it here at Barrett Stew. I don't know the brand at all. Come on, guys. Come on. Come on, everybody. Come on. 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 Together. You look like a model. Get in the picture. <laughs> Make sure my stomach is sucked in. Uh, I'll airbrush it later. <laughs> Say hi. Say Jamaica. 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 No problem. Thank you very much. Yep, he's lucky to even got it back. Ain't no telling what he actually paid for it. Lose him. Well, he got his board back. Squeezing the lot. I said, into a story that uh, was successful with him getting his board back. Jumps not bad at all. Yep. If we had another place for people here, we sleep. Once people know y'all had fun, they'll they'll come back next year. Holland, they're looking for a spot around the world with good conditions, yeah? Yeah. In December and January. And they make it good. They're sitting, for example, two months on People they know here. And the people are coming, they're just making transfers to the airport for new jobs and help to manage. So you were happy with the accommodations? Perfect. Yeah, it's beautiful. The people know that we're here. Perfect, it's just quite a year. Beautiful house. Everyone got like over 50 meters. There is a pool. Great set. Yeah, you can almost see the beach from here. This is how they put uh, kite boards and kite equipment and windsurf equipment on top of a car. They just kind of like pile it up and strap it down and pray that when they go down the road that damn stuff don't fly off but it's what it is
All right, well, I think we're going to cut another location later today. We've scouted it earlier this morning. But um, um, we do our videotape from there. But it's really different place than I've ever cut it before because I've only cut it this so-called Burwood Beach. But hey, look, I got to cut all kinds of different water situations. It's a breakwater. In other words, it's where the big cruise ships come in and there's not near as big waves as it is out here. I know the video doesn't show how big these waves are, but man, they are big. Even today, they calm down. They still are choppy big. All right, they just about got it. 